Well, it's a cool morning out there, Todd. I'm surprised you're not wearing a jacket because temperatures continue to dip for us. 59 degrees for Indianapolis, about 53 for Fishers. So, yeah, jacket weather this morning. But by afternoon, another afternoon that's just beautiful out there. All right, so we start you at 8.30 this morning at 62 for Indy, about 61 for Columbus. So we start you out this morning pretty much where we started yesterday morning. Not much change in the 24-hour temperature change map here. By your lunch hour, it still feels fantastic. A few clouds building in at 75 for Indianapolis, 75 for you around the Fishers area, about 75 for Bloomington as well. Now, overall high temperatures for today in the upper 70s to right around 80 degrees. Indy, I think, will get really close to that 80 degree mark today. Uh, areas surrounding mostly in the upper 70s. So we do have some cooler air sitting around Lafayette. Your temperatures will not warm much throughout the day today. So. 80 will be your high temperature for Indy. Lafayette, I think you stay in the 70s. 82 for Columbus. So a nice day today. A little humidity creeping back in. And tonight, I think conditions are slim, similar to what we saw last night and early this morning. Dripping down to the 50s for most of us. All right, so let's get into what happens this evening. Models are now putting in a spot shower after 6 p.m., but cloud cover mostly our greater chance for seeing showers and storms that will start to move in on Saturday morning. You see these kind of spotty showers moving in. Not a major threat for severe weather at this point, but as you get into the evening hours, we start to see some of the stronger storms slide to the south, mostly south of Interstate 70 here. Uh, I do think we have a threat for showers and storms, but the larger threat really comes in on Sunday and here it is. As you can see 4 a.m. Sunday morning, we start you and we see some showers and storms kind of lining up here south of Bloomington and then they begin to feel in. You can see widespread showers and storms moving through the area. Peru, you can see some heavy storms, uh, the possibility of severe weather at this point on Sunday. So we are under the risk for severe weather both Saturday and Sunday, but I think the greater risk really moves in on Sunday. You can see the severe weather map here showing us under that risk. Here are the major risks as we talked about wind, hail, and the possibility of an isolated tornado. We can't rule that out as these storms roll in. Here's your weekend forecast. Very warm on Saturday. Saturday, Sunday, not as warm, but still very humid with those storms rolling in. Seven day planning forecast. Temperatures continue to warm and then a big cool down next week as temperatures fall to only 70 degrees on Tuesday.